Welcome to Accenture's first um, entrepreneurship roundup. Uh, these will be regular segments where we update you on uh, what we've been doing in the field of entrepreneurship and innovation programs um, across the world and uh, across uh, Accenture's business. Today for the first one, uh, I am going to explain a little bit about uh, what we've been up to in the past quarter, some of the exciting news and updates uh, uh, and new programs and projects that we will be launching soon. Um, and I will also round up a little bit about my thoughts of what's happening uh, uh, around the world in this sector. We're very pleased to announce our renewed partnership with the Royal Academy of Engineering uh, on delivering the Leaders in Innovation Fellowship Global 2024 program. Um, this is an early stage entrepreneurship capacity building program where this year we will be taking 65, up to 65 innovators, early stage technology innovators from eight countries around the world, uh, including Colombia, Turkey, Jordan, South Africa, uh, India, the Philippines, Thailand and Malaysia. And we will be um, supporting them through an eight month training and mentoring program, which includes elements delivered virtually, elements delivered in country and a two week residential program in the UK where they will be immersed in the UK ecosystem in July. We're also pleased to announce um, expansion and renewal of our partnership with Santander through a series of initiatives. Uh, first of all, this month we finished uh, the Santander X Global Challenge, Cyber Protect the Future where uh, we, in partnership with Santander X, sought uh, and scouted the best cyber security uh, startups and scale-ups from around the world. Uh, we evaluated them, we selected the top 10 uh, startups and top 10 scale-ups who then participated in a pitch day to select the winners. The winners were announced at the Web Summit in Lisbon, uh, where they received an award, which consisted of a financial reward, as well as a series of incentives to connect them with Santander and the bank. With Santander, we have also been running entrepreneurship competitions in various countries. We ran a, um, a semi-final for the Santander X UK Awards at the Oval in London, where 100 businesses, entrepreneurship projects and uh, startups pitched them for a place in the national final on the 7th of December. Prior to this, we had run a couple of days of boot camp in Birmingham, where we trained some of the startups and we helped them understand what uh, a good pitch deck looks like together with other experts in preparation for this event. We also uh, are working on organizing uh, the final pitch day for the Santander X Poland Award, which will happen on the 7th of December at the Warsaw Stock Exchange. And here, uh, 10 businesses, 10 startups, 10 Polish startups will be um, pitching for a chance to compete in the Santander X Global Awards, which will happen in February 2024 in Barcelona. We're also pleased to announce the expansion of our partnerships and international programs. Um, first of all, it's my pleasure to announce that in early December at COP28 in Dubai, we will, will be officially launching our newest accelerator program partnership, where we will be working with uh, uh, Dennis Bank Neohub, uh, Dennis Bank, uh, one of the largest financial institutions in Turkey, um, Dennis Bank Neohub being their startup uh, uh, accelerator and incubator uh, arm. Uh, together with, with whom we will be organizing a new accelerator program called Truck Accelerator, which will focus on taking early stage sustainability uh, startups and businesses headquartered in Turkey and bringing them through in a nine month journey of internationalization towards the UK. Uh, as I said, we will be announcing this as part of COP28, so uh, uh, watch this space for a formal announcement on that accelerator program. We're also pleased to announce uh, a new partnership formed with Accelerate Estonia. Accelerate Estonia is the national innovation lab of the Estonian government where they take startups and allow them to operate in Estonia in a facilitated regulatory environment to help them break down those early regulation barriers that often stop startups from uh, scaling successfully. Uh, by providing them with um, a facilitated environment for them to pilot their solutions within Estonia. Uh, Oxentia is, is very pleased to announce that we will be um, forming a partnership with, with Accelerate Estonia to help them uh, create pipeline from the UK towards their programs. And we, um, in order to do this, we will be running an official event uh, uh, in late February next year 
uh, where we, we will be showcasing um, some of these startups and, and what this program can do for them. We are heading over to Lima in Peru, where we'll be, we will be running the final event for the Programa de Innovación de Tecnología Limpias, which is a, a program that has been running for over 10 months, uh, funded by the IDB and by the, um, the Peruvian government through uh, Ministerio de Producción and uh, Pro Innovate. This program has taken over 120 uh, innovation specialists across, across the public and private sector and built their capacity, built their strengths uh, in supporting the creation of a clean tech innovation ecosystem within the country. On the 28th of November, we will be running a final event where 20 projects uh, that have been uh, accelerated throughout the program will be presenting to uh, an audience and the best ones will, will be rewarded with further support. Last month, we attended uh, the IRAP conference organized in Warsaw by the Foundation for Polish Science, where they showcased uh, some of the results from their Center of Excellence projects. Uh, as part of this conference, we also uh, announced uh, preliminarily our partnership with the Foundation for Polish Science uh, for the creation of a new program to foster academic entrepreneurship in Poland. Uh, more details of this uh, will hopefully be announced uh, uh, within uh, the next few months. Uh, uh, with the idea of activities starting in early 2024. So we're very excited to uh, expand into Poland, not just through the work we do with Santander, but also through this new program, new projects with the Foundation for Polish Science. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you want to know more about all of the exciting developments that uh, we have as Accentia within the entrepreneurship sector across the world, uh, please reach out uh, and otherwise, uh, please keep following us for updates. Thank you.